Thank you guys for coming. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome to Bruin Self Defense Quick Tips. Today, from the household, we're going to look at how to use a tea towel or a basic small cloth for methods of self defense. We call these improvised weapons. A tea towel is not designed to be a self defense weapon or an offensive weapon, but we can use it as such. One of the easiest ways with a nice small cloth like this, in case you have trouble, is to just throw it over someone's face so they're temporarily blinded, they can't see you, and you can escape. One of the most important things to remember in self-defense is that you want to escape, not to win. You could throw a couple of punches in that. You throw it on their face, lands, and they get punched a couple of times, they can't see what's going on. That'll give you extra opportunity too. If you want to use it as more of an offensive weapon, your fight's already happened, you need to actually physically engage, well you can just hold it. It's good to twist it up a little bit. If you can find, I don't have my, my mop from the previous video, but if you can dip the end in water it becomes a little harder and it hurts more when you, uh, when you get hit by it. So from here, I'm not going to do much damage by swinging these big swings here. Unless I've sewn shells or rocks or things into the seams here, which many cultures do for their self-defense weapons, uh, that's not going to hurt too much. What I can do is flick it. Now notice I'm holding it both ends. I'm using my left hand so I'm saying to fire it. And the right hand is almost aiming. I want to aim it down there, it goes down there. I want to aim up there, it goes over there. Over here, I whip it over there. And then I can switch hands as well. I tend to be a little bit more accurate, a little bit faster with my left, but you can use both as well. In this double hand position as well, this is good for putting into the face. So if someone comes very close to you, basically it's going to be here, and you pull them together, and it hits here. I don't want to do it too hard on myself. Right there, just popping it into the face right here. And obviously, you can wrap around and you can look at all kinds of different chokes. There are some martial arts which use all kinds of binding techniques to disarm weapons like knives, sticks, tire irons, things like that. They require a lot of complex technical moves and have to be incredibly lucky to pull off in a timing manner. So those are part of martial arts, but not necessarily very effective for self-defense. But as you can see, tea towel can be used, throw over, distract. It can be used as a flexible weapon to whip, or it can be used two-handed to divert and block, and still to strike as well. So go play and train with your uh, uh, kitchen towel, your uh, tea towel there, whatever you want to call it, and uh, have fun. Stay safe and enjoy your training, boys.